Well, so I bought a Lay's. It is definitely too big for my garage, but eh, I don't care. Picked this thing up for much less than its weight in scrap, and well, it's a bit rusty. Good news though, things mostly spin. Some of this moves easily, some of it doesn't. <sighs> Gonna have to start tearing things apart, finding out what works well, what doesn't. Like, carriage seems to be locked up on something, maybe just seized with rust. Tailstock handle doesn't really do anything right now. Might be just off the threads. Got the uh, quick change gearbox here. The small uh, set pin seems to be stuck in place, so I can actually change the gears on, on some of this. So at least these, all these upper knobs can move if I adjust the head while turning everything. I'm gonna have to figure out the problem of power though. It's of course hooked up with the stock three phase and yeah it's, uh definitely don't have three phase here can't get it might end up building a rotary phase converter or buying one notice some things on here like i'm not sure if that's stock and i know that's not But other than that, it looks like a lot of this stuff was still kept well oiled, and I'm hopeful that a lot of the internal gearing is going to be in good condition, even if uh, some of the exposed threads are a little bit worse for the wear, but should be pretty good. I do know that it looks like this came with the tapering attachment, but it's missing some parts, so... If I ever want to use that, I'll have to look into getting some parts for it. But yeah. That's this lathe I picked up. Well, I'm, I'll hope to upload some videos documenting some of the repairs on this as they come along. Some of the weird things about this though is it looks like somebody decided to make their own bolt for that, but yeah. <laughs> anyway, but.